Why, hello! Are the beginnings of all of my videos running together yet? I realize they always start out on the overworld map. Um, there's not much I can do about that. Uh, oh well. Um, here you can see I'm pointing it out because Dosan was annihilated in the last part. Um, her troops all replenished on their own, and that's part of what a monk is. I never had a good opportunity to show that off before, so I figured I'd do that now. Um, I don't need her selected specifically. I need to replenish all my troops. There we go. And, uh, my territories are looking good, so I guess we're gonna start fighting more demon army, baby! Oh, yeah! And, uh, we'll probably see Agareda again, which is what I want. Oh, boy, do I want that. Um... You probably noticed I have the sniffles in most of my videos. I apologize. I have horrible, horrible allergies. It's springtime, and my house is riddled with pets and bullshit. So, you know, it's just how it is. Um, Toshihisa is here. Now, he is not scary. Look at his troop size. He's irrelevant at this point. He doesn't matter anymore at all. So, he's going to be easy to deal with, and Sonata is going to go... I guess Koei May should go again, hey? Yeah, um, Layla's gonna go... Dosan can go... Dosan, I'm gonna save her for Agarita, actually. Rance will go. Um... I don't know. I, I don't really need much. It's not a hard fight. Uh, I guess Ando. <laughs> Alright. Um, this plays... Before you fight Toshihi. So once you get to the stage in the game, this plays. Um... It's important, and, you know, it's, you know, it's, uh, Toshi, he says, hopeful that his older brother will show up. He hasn't given up totally, but he kind of knows. He, he knows he's dead. Um, and really, that's one of the only times you see Toshi, he's, uh, thinking about somebody else. He's a pretty selfish guy, as far as I can tell. Um, but in his death sequence, you can see him as a pretty... A pretty good person. He seems really stuck up and selfish before this point, but I think he uh he comes through as a good guy. All the Shimazu brothers are good guys, you know? None of them are evil, none of them are bad people. They're just stuck in really bad situations. And uh it's it's sad. Gonko, what are you doing with them? Oh no. But uh you can see there, start attacking. Don't let the infected people fight better than us. That's that's where the Shimazu army's at right now. And it's really sad to see them fall so far. I didn't bring Kenshin with because she's not needed. You know, I I have he's gonna get one shot. Shimazu Toshihi says basically he's gonna get one shot. So You know. I have Ando too, which I'm still I always feel Ando, and I don't even know why. Like I don't even know why I bring him. <laughs> he's just there. He's just he's just being Ando. I don't know. Uh, this is interesting. Fucking do this. I can't waste her attack bonus. You know I've got to use that on something that matters. Toshihisa is gonna get tore up by anybody, but oh boy, hit this too. And Yamamoto will kill the infected and hit the bongos. Rance will mess up Tosh. He's, uh, he's got the coolest name to abbreviate, you know. Tosh. Oh, it's Shimazu Tosh. Get ready. You know, he's cool. I like that name. And I don't know. I don't know, man. Wow, what a deadly attack from... You know, it's, it's a sad day when 1,770 people... Can't even kill 50 of Koei May's troops. That's a... That's pathetic, you know? Damn. I understand they're zombies, but... Damn, you know? Oh, well. It's just a big mob. Oh, bongo drums. Oh, my God. It's, I don't even... Oh, yeah, summon ogre. I, yeah, I explained that. It's a shitty skill. Well, when Ando has it, it's a shitty skill. It's identical to Sone's ability. It's just that Sone's is a higher level. And the higher level of Summon Ogre consumes two flags. Sone's doesn't do that. Sone's only consumes, you know, one. Sonida, hit the bongos. Kill the bongos. Destroy the bongos. I wonder if they have blood or anything. They don't even look like they're alive, you know? But 
these fights will uh, be easy. And you can expect to see Kazuhisa and Iehisa sometime soon as well. Very, very soon, actually. Um, yeah. But those guys are gone. Uh, the, the infected. Also, so you guys are aware, I'm working to uh, the Demon Army's last territory. I'm going to go through all of their main territories. I'm not going to finish the game over at the side like you are able to do. Um, well, this is Toshihisa's death sequence, and it's fitting for him as well. I, li like I've stated before, I think they all have a fitting death. Um, fitting for their character, fitting for the roles that they played. And, uh, they're, they're not, they're not really disgraceful deaths, you know? None of them die in some horrible way. It's not like Layla when she's captured by the demon army. These are all fairly noble. You know, Yoshihisa died for his siblings. Toshihisa died after a battle and helped his subordinate and himself. The youngest brother is killed in combat and, uh, Kazuhisa dies trying to avenge his youngest brother. It's it's pretty good. You know, if if they had to die, I think they've died in a way that is appropriate. So, there you go. And really the only inappropriate deaths in the game are when people like Maria are killed in combat, you know? Because Maria loves Rance. She's a character from previous games. She's in, she's a big deal. No one says anything about it. And those are the only inappropriate deaths in the game, in my opinion. Um, uh, just about every other death is fitting, so. I mean, I, I have to think, as usual, I'm, I'm trying to think through all, my, all the deaths. But they're all pretty fitting, as far as I can remember, so. But uh, Toshihisa dies with, with the hope that, you know, Kurohime will be saved. But, uh, that's how that goes. And, uh, we keep fighting the demon army, you know? Despite the fact that he's dead. You know, that doesn't throw Oda into chaos, surprisingly. Um, Jenry, go ahead and scout. Thank you, bro. You're a bro. Um, alright, well, I guess we're getting a, a bonus, uh, if you want to call it that. Uh, this is kind of a predetermined fight. Morocco Kings, um, and Monaco Kings, they're... They're not really predetermined, I guess, but they show up a whole bunch because I don't I don't really know why, but they they're around a lot, so note them. <laughs> um, unfortunately, I'm not gonna be fighting Agarita if she shows up because I'm not gonna have the forces for it. I'm gonna have to deploy pretty uh decently for this battle here. So, oh god, did they have a guard? No guard. All right, Kento will go instead of Son. But, uh, I don't think either of these men know that their other brother died as well. Um, they don't know that Toshihisa is gone. Um, and like I stated in a previous video, Kazuhisa and Iehisa go, go as a pair. But I think that they might be able to die before Toshihisa. It just depends whether you encounter them in combat. I'm not sure about this. Um, every time for me it's been Toshihisa first. But I don't think that is a required scenario. You know what I mean? So, I, I guess be aware of it. I don't know. It's not really something to be aware of. Just, <laughs> it's there. Um, un another easy fight. But at this stage in the game, the battles with the Demon Army aren't supposed to be as imposing or difficult as they were. They, they're done. The Demon Army's finished. Is basically what's happening. And, uh, actually, in Yamamoto's route, they realize it. You know, Xavier and Mado realize that that's what's happening. Um, they don't realize it here. They, they just keep going. So, yeah. Um, but I'm not sure about the stats for the Morocco King and the Monaco King. And there's, like, there's one for the Amazon as well. And it's, I don't think it's a king. Um, but whatever. Uh, yeah, healing mist. Um, something interesting. That Morocco King is a woman, and, uh, the Demon King is a woman. So, I guess they just decided to, uh, centralize the term for any leaders. That's fine with me. It, it's just weird. 
It's just unavoidably weird. Uh, attack. One shot that. I I would have had Senime attack Kazuhisa, but she's missing uh, a defense or offensive arrow, and I don't want her getting eaten. You know. Let's throw up a battle strategy for my guys, so he can remove it. Um, didn't get cats though, thankfully. Let's finish off the Monaco King. Monaco King. Um, yeah. <laughs> there isn't a. There isn't really a lot to say about the Demon Army's conflicts now because they are so similar. God damn it! Oh my God! It's a 1,000 troop bongo drum unit. Oh, it's infuriating. And it's got a speed boost, you know? It can't just... It, oh, I'm disgusted. Easy fight, though. I think Kazuhisa has low intelligence. I don't know about that. The brothers are all very good. Um, I guess. I don't I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> um, also, I'll call this out now because it's more relevant now than it ever has been before. The background is tropical. The fight sequence background is tropical. You know, like the Amazon, right? <laughs> Intended, and I appreciate that. Um, the Yokai territories have a very attractive background image, if I recall. We're gonna go there in another playthrough, and it's gonna look like shit, and I'm gonna look stupid. But uh, I recall it being pretty. So, um, I don't know what happens if uh, the Shimazu brothers win in their battle against you. You know, if Kazuhisa and Iehisa had won this fight. I don't know if there's a different dialogue sequence for that, or a different event. I've never lost in these situations against them. So, yeah, I'm not sure about that, but here in this scene, Iehisa has been shot with an arrow, or several arrows, and he's he's dying, essentially. He's not going to make it. Um, always kind of interesting if you don't have any bow units in your army, but, uh, the game assumes that you've got at least a tactician or an archer. Um, in either case, it doesn't spoil the scene. But uh, Iahisa dies here. Kazuhisa, you know, it was his job. It, he had to look after his youngest brother, you know. Um, he was doing that for his older brother. And uh, it's a touching scene. I don't have any male siblings. But, I mean... I can I can very easily understand the feelings that were put into this scene here, and uh, it's a it's a troubling scene if you you know feel for those characters at all, or if you even try to feel for them. It's a it's a touching scene. Um, let me see what I'm gonna do here. <laughs> uh, there isn't really much left to do. I'm gonna no, I'm not gonna have economy scout actually. Uh, let me give some items to Sagan. Um, oh, a defensive book. Um, yeah, I'm sitting here quiet now, and I'm not thinking. Uh, no one really... No one needs that. Um, these stats don't help in commander battles, so I wouldn't give something like that to Kentaro. So you're aware of that. Um, fucking exclusive nurse. Heals 50 troops for the unit you give it to per turn, just uh, so you know what that is. I don't think I've shown it before. And here's the item I got in a part previously that I said I hadn't gotten before, Elokin Miso. Increases negotiation, and I have gotten that before. I was mistaken. Um, Sagan, have some goddamn cup. Hope you love me. Awesome. And we will do this here. Uh, Ando, not Ando, we'll do Kenshin's. Um, there we go. Just so I can, uh, get her a new st ability or stat or something. Um, and finish up the part here. But, uh, it's weird that I haven't seen a, an H scene with Kenshin yet. I know that there are some in True Route. Um, or at least one, but whatever. Here's your power-up. Uh, level 70? Am I gonna do that? I am. There you go, Kenshin. Level 70. I have level-capped Kenshin. Uh, we'll unturn and see if anything plays here as well. Um, yeah. So Kenshin's level cap is 70. Um, Masamune's, I think, is... Oh, boy. I'll be wrong. It's like... He starts at 86 or something, 88, I don't know, not 80, no, 67 rather, what am I, what the fuck am I talking about? I don't remember his, <laughs> I don't remember his stuff. Don't quote me. But uh, Amazon is being attacked, oh no. So we'll scout it with Niwa, 
Gonko. There we go. It's probably going to be Agareda, and I'm going to be pissed off because I don't have the units to fight her. Yeah, so... I said I wouldn't do this, but I am here because I don't want to lose this territory. That's how that's going to go. I'll see you guys in the next part. You won't miss anything.